Hello friends, welcome to this new video tutorial. In this quick video, I will show you how to upgrade Redmi Note 3 to Marshmallow. Now if uh, your Redmi Note 3 has a stable ROM, then it is possible that your uh, Redmi Note 3 is not yet upgraded to Marshmallow. So to upgrade Redmi Note 3 to Marshmallow, you will need a developer ROM which is also called as a global beta room so let's see what are the prerequisites for uh, upgrading redmi note 3 to marshmallow so first of all you need a 64 bit system it will not work on 32 bit system so then you will need a redmi note 3 in edl mode also called as download mode then you will need a latest fast boot ROM. This ROM is required because most of you will be upgrading from stable ROM and if you directly upgrade from the updater app then it is possible that you may break your phone. So you will need a latest global beta fast boot ROM and then lastly you will need mi flash tool which works on 64 bit system so let's get started how you can upgrade your redmi note 3 to marshmallow so this particular guide will work for all those people who have uh, logged bootloader on their redmi note 3 and are willing to upgrade it to marshmallow so you don't need to unlock the bootloader here you can straight away flash it with the lock bootloader also first of all you will need to go to the thread which i have mentioned in the description down below it is a miui forum thread where uh, you will get the latest passport room so you can uh, download that particular fastboot room to your computer so this is the thread which i am talking about and it has all the links to download so we will jump on to redmi note 3 qualcomm and uh, if you have chipset of qualcomm then you can download this fastboot rom to your computer so i have already downloaded this particular rom so once you download it just open mi flash tool on your computer so I will go to MI Flash. So I will right click on it and run as administrator. So once you have installed all the drivers to your PC, you will see MI Flash tool like this. So once you install all the ADB drivers and other necessary drivers your MI flash tool will open like this. Now you will have to extract the downloaded ROM to any of the drive on your computer like this. So I have extracted it to E drive so you can see the folder like this then go to MI flash tool now you will need to put your redmi note 3 into download mode EDL mode so if you can't 
put it into download mode using the volume up and power key then you can put it into download mode using the windows command script so once you have connected your uh, redmi note 3 in download mode to your pc you can flash the rom from here so we will see how you can flash it so first of all you will need to locate the images so browse and go to the extracted folder of kenzo global images and choose images and then press okay then go to advanced settings and browse again and choose flash all bad files from the extracted folder then choose raw xml and patch xml from the same folder so once you have located all these files you can go ahead and refresh and your device will show here right now i don't have connected my redmi note 3 here so i don't have the device here but it will show your device with com 10 or com 20 like that so once you see your device here you can select it and flash the room so the flashing process will take around 5 to 10 minutes and after the flashing process is finished you can go ahead and reboot your phone it may take some while to reboot because if you are moving from stable to global beta room then it will take some time and uh, once you have successfully rebooted you can go ahead and check your uh, about phone settings and you will see that it runs on marshmallow that's it for this video friends for more tips and tricks you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also please don't forget to visit my blog technologywindow.com don't forget to like and share this video with all the people who are trying to upgrade their redmi note 3 to marshmallow bye bye and i will see you in my next video Where it's been 700 degrees in here since you came in. I could swear that this room has been running out of air and now it's starting to spin.